Seven Questions with Stephen Brad. Seven Questions with Stephen Brad. It's another episode of Seven Questions with Stephen Brad. Seven Questions, and we have the boss, the boss. of all bosses. Oh, and he's look flexing. At that. Oh Mauricio Bernard. What's up, Maurice? <gasps> How you guys doing? We're doing oh, amazing, dude. dude. How you doing today, buddy? Doing good, real good. Awesome. It's good to see you, man. It's good to see you. Um, so we're going to ask you some dumb questions now. Okay. <laughs> and he expects nothing less from Spinelli. What was the last movie that made you cry? Wow. Uh, cause I cry a lot, <laughs> man, boy, the last movie that made me cry was, uh, what did I just see? Cause I haven't seen a lot of movies or a TV but, show. What's something that that's made you cry lately? Uh, maybe 90 day fiance. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's amazing. <laughs> no, I know. No, that was a joke, but but, but I, do watch, I do watch that. It's great. <laughs> uh, but I don't think that really made me cry. I think, I think probably American Idol. Not American Idol. America's Got Talent. America's Got Talent, yeah. Yeah, yeah they, tell, they tell great stories, for sure. Sure. For they sure. really bring the human element in. And yeah, I, no. I love that. Awesome. If you were to go on America's Got Talent, what talent would you choose uh i would probably uh take my shirt off <laughs> come on you would you would you would do a monologue <laughs> they don't have that man they well we're gonna add monologue. a new category for you that you could do a monologue yeah Maybe like in I could interpretive box interpretive boxing like if you could like do some choreography with no some no monologue. you know what it would be bro what's that Man. Dancing. Dancing. All right. Nice. Yeah. yeah. What, what type? What type of dancing would we be hey, doing here? Style soul dancing, man. If you could add four hours to your day, what would you spend that four hours doing? Like now? Yeah. If you could add an extra four hours to the day, how would you fill it? Oh, don't add any more hours to the day. <laughs> <laughs> Especially during this time, right? Oh, yeah. My right. goodness. If you had four hours, I'm I'm a, I'm gone, man. Uh, <laughs> what would I I don't uh I like the sleeping part of the hour. Yeah. Maurice, out of all of Sonny's enemies over the years, who was your most worthy adversary? You, you've had a lot of good enemies, so. But I've had a lot of bad enemies. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's true, too. Uh, I'd have to probably say, even though it was a, <laughs> in my book, it's a little different, but I'd say, <laughs> I'd say Alcazar, man. Yeah. 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 He, was, he was a strong guy, yeah. Yeah. What small thing oh, makes great. you <laughs> makes you angrier than it should? Like uh, maybe so, like you know, like um, uh oh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> that really got to steam. Don't do it, dude. Don't even do it, Maurice. Don't do it. <laughs> Just answer the question as asked. So I guess maybe it could That's be a it, pet peeve, okay? like a pet peeve or like a small thing that gets you, gets you more angry than maybe it should. Well, <laughs> I can't really that. answer that a hundred percent honest just because I have <laughs> my own reasons. Oh, small thing gets me really upset. Oh, like a pet peeve. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Like would, a pet peeve. I would just say, uh, rude people mm. like if i'm if i'm gonna go to a uh like a to buy something and the and sometimes i don't know if they're just rude on purpose or they just don't like me or they just watch y and r but, <laughs> but uh you know how some people are just rude yeah sure do <laughs> if 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 you were a real mobster yeah 
and could make up your own name, what would it be? Uh, probably like the, I like Sonny. The Sonny's cool. The name. Mm-hmm. Uh, Sonny K, short for killer. Ooh, oh, watch out. Yeah, I thought we were gonna like get that. a I thought we were gonna get a funny one. No, it's wow. that's he's he takes this stuff seriously. <laughs> like I I, I I thought Sonny Licious would be good. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I still had that lollipop. Sonny Licious, that's right. right. And had my face on it. <laughs> it was amazing. Who someone someone made you a lollipop? With his face on it. Who took that? <laughs> Wait a second. Was your face on the wrapper or was the lollipop like a bust of your head? My face was on the lollipop, not the wrapper. Yeah. So was it a bust or like a, like a picture? Oh, it was just his head. Picture of my face. Oh, wow. That's Sunny. Yeah, that's, that's cool. nice. I like that. So it is Sunny Delicious. It is Sunny Delicious, yeah. I love that. How Amazing. many licks does it take to get to the center of a Sunny Delicious? <laughs> of all the places you've traveled, what is your favorite place that you've traveled? I'd have to say Puerto Rico. Mm. Yeah. Puerto Rico. Now, was the first time that you went to Puerto Rico for GH? Yeah, uh, when I did this, uh, the storyline with, with Sonny and Brenda. And El yeah. It was the hotel. Yeah, El and, Conquistador. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I remember going with my dad then, the second, I think second or third time. And it was the greatest. We went gambling in the casino. And he was losing everything. So he's like, my dad's like, I'm going to go to bed. I'm not winning nothing. I said, all right, Dad, go to bed. Well, I don't know what happened, but everything that I touched, like in the- uh, Yeah, slots, everything. Slots, you were... I won. So I won 800 once, boom. I won another 1,000 here, boom. And then I won two thousand, no, uh, $2,050 in one shot. It's five wow. point. So I called my dad, I said, Dad, you got to come up. <laughs> <laughs> I've winning everything. <laughs> I go, you got to come up here. He goes, what? what? What are you winning? I said, just come up here. And he saw that I won 4500 bucks. Oh, man. Wow. That's awesome. So he was kind of your bad luck charm. Well, he, yeah, he was pissed <laughs> off that I won. Yeah, he went to bed angry, and he woke up angrier. <laughs> De Niro or Pacino? <sighs> I'd say uh, old Pacino. Old, wait, wait, old Pacino or no, early Pacino? Early Pacino, new uh, and new De Niro. And recent De Niro. Yeah, although Pacino was incredible in uh, what, the, what Scorsese just directed on Netflix. The Irishman. Yeah. The, but the, that, it's Jimmy Hoffa, I thought. It could be. It could be in there somewhere, yeah. But the early Pacino, you can't touch. You cannot touch yeah. Dog Day Afternoon. Serpico. Serpico. Yeah. Uh, you can go down the line. And- I, I remember when, I, when you, know, you were helping me act, teaching me, yeah. and we would watch a ta- Serpico, the tape. You had the VHS oh, man. of Serpico in your room. Yes. yes. And I remember you saying there was a scene with him and his wife. Yes. Right, and you go watch this scene. Yes, and and it was a one day one day shoot with her and him, but he took her out to dinner. They talked for hours yes. just to have the yes. the the relationship on camera that was needed to play his wife. So it was it was awesome. All right, last question: What's your favorite movie of all time? Well, I mean, the obvious answer is... What's the obvious answer? Godfather, Godfather 2, right? Is it? Well, yeah, I mean, anybody who thinks, you know, that I play this gangster thinks they're gonna, I'm going to say that, which I am. It's, it is one, one of my favorite. But I think, I think, in all honesty, there's three for me, which is Dead Man Walking with Sean Penn. Mm. Blow, blow Your Mind. Mm-hmm. And Menace to Society which is mm. a gangster movie yeah. that I went to see twice in the theater. And it, it, it makes you feel all nervous and stuff. It was so cool. But that, Dead Man Walking 
what Sean Penn does in there. And also, what's her name? She won the Oscar and I can't Susan remember. Sarandon? Yes. Yeah. She was phenomenal. It was just phenomenal. Awesome. Yeah. You guys didn't see it? Yeah, it was a bit a long time ago. Oh, uh, uh, right. I mean, a long time ago, yeah. And what yeah. about Scarface? No. Oh, okay. No, but I, but I, but I think it's fantastic. Straight from the boss's mouth. You heard it here first. Yeah, well, because it's 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 not best movie. But it's favorite, right? So you can, and also it's a cult favorite. You no, know, that movie didn't do well early on, and and now it's like. Everybody knows it and loves yeah. it. Yeah. Awesome. Seven Thanks. questions with Maurice Bernard. Thank you, Maurice. The original boss. Thank you. That of daytime. Good. We laughed a lot. That's fun. That was fun. <laughs> hey guys, Steve Bradford here. As you know, we like things that are fun and awesome. <laughs> we even named our podcast after awesome. And we are so excited to welcome you to our Patreon. Go behind the scenes with us at General Hospital on our comedy tours and even in our real lives. You're going to see things that nobody else gets to see. So if you want more stuff like this, and this, check out my dressing room, and this, oh yeah, you're in the right place. More exclusive content and more access than ever before. Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the Stone Cold and Jackal Patreon, Patreon channel. channel. Woo! <laughs>